In this video, let us continue to solve more problems based on hyperbola. All right, here we've got the question here which says uh, find the coordinates of the foci and the vertices, the eccentricity, the length of the lattice rectum of the hyperbola whose equation is y squared minus 16x squared equals 16. So this is definitely not the standard form. So to convert it to the standard form, all that we have to do is uh, we need a 1 on the right hand side. So we can get 1 on the right hand side if we can divide it by 16. But we cannot divide just the right hand side by 16. So we'll have to divide the entire equation by 16. So let's divide the entire equation by 16, after which we get y squared divided by 16 minus x squared divided by 1 equals 1. All right, so this uh, clearly says us, uh, tells us what kind of, uh, what form of the equation it is. It is of the form y squared divided by a squared minus x squared divided by b squared equals 1. So from this, we have a equals to 4 and b equals to 1. We have c squared equals a squared plus b squared or c equals square root of a squared plus b squared for which we get square root of 4 squared plus 1 squared. So therefore, c equals square root of 17. So we found the value of c to be equal to square root of 17. So now we can find the coordinates of the four side. So now c equals the square root of 17. So now we can find the coordinates of the four side. The four side is given by 0 comma c and 0 comma minus c because it is not of the form x squared by a squared minus y squared by b squared, but it is otherwise. I mean, this is the hyperbola that opens upwards and downwards. So now we have the foci as 0 comma root 17 and 0 comma minus of root 17. All right, now that we found the foci, we can find the vertices. The vertices, the coordinates of the vertices are given by 0 comma a and 0 comma minus a. So we have 0 comma 4 and 0 comma minus 4. And then we have to find the eccentricity which is given by e equals to c by a, which will be equal to root of 17, square root of 17 divided by 4. So that's the eccentricity of the given hyperbola. And finally, we have to find the length of the lattice rectum, which is given by 2b squared by a. So 2b squared would be 2 times 1, that will be 2 divided by a is 4. So we have 1 by 2 as the length of the lattice rectum of the hyperbola y squared minus 16x squared equals to 16. All right, so that ends this simple problem as well as this video. I'll see you in the forthcoming videos with more problems based on hyperbola.